Your love viewers, your loyal listeners, your everyone. Thank you once again for joining me on Team Up TV. Please don't forget to subscribe if you are coming here for the first time. If you're regular, just to the usual. Please like and comment and also share our video so that others may just see what to do here. Because what we do is we give you current affairs in real time. So yes, the opposition citizens coalition for change, the triple C, they say they are open to dialogue, but on condition it will be held under a foundation built on respect for democratic principles and adherence to established electoral standards. In a series of posts on X, the Triple C said while the party understands the necessity for a dialogue as a means of fostering unity and progress, there's a need to acknowledge numerous irregularities that marred the general elections of 23 August 2023. Triple C was responding to sentiments by Father Fidelis Mukonori that leader Nelson Chamisa should accept defeat and engage with Emerson Dambuzo Munangagwa. President Munangagwa emerged victorious with 52% share of the vote, while Triple C leader Chamisa got 44%. Chamisa has since disputed this outcome, saying the elections were blatant and gigantic fraud, and his party has since demanded a fresh election. Triple C posted on X saying, We understand the importance of dialogue as a means to foster unity and progress. However, we firmly believe that genuine dialogue requires a foundation built on truth and respect for democratic principles and adherence to established electoral standards. Without proper acknowledgement and redress of the electoral irregularities, any dialogue would lack the necessary credibility and integrity. Election observer missions in their findings said the elections were held under a restrictive political environment. The election observer missions criticized the handling of electoral processes by the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission while highlighting arbitrary arrest of opposition members and local observers. In light of these findings, our stance remains unwavering. It is our firm belief that the true will of the people has been impended, thereby casting doubt on the legitimacy of the proclaimed winner. As a citizen movement led by Chamisa, we have a duty to challenge such irregularities and fight for justice on behalf of the electorate through a free, fresh and transparent election, added the opposition. While we respect the right of individuals regardless of their political or religious and cultural affiliations to express their opinions we believe it is morally right for individuals to express to express themselves in a progressive ethical unifying respectful and honest manner the recently ended elections were marred by numerous irregularities that have been widely acknowledged by regional continental and international observers these impartial observers have unequivocally stated that the elections failed to meet both domestic and foreign electoral standards, failing short of being free and fair.